Uh, my magic, okay, here we are. We have a new policy in place. I think that we need a national commission that would study net energy returns. And they would be fully empowered, they'd have as much money as they needed, and they would study every possible crevice of what does it mean to convert something from one thing to another. So here's an example. Um, we have this huge corn ethanol program going on, but we don't really know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. We have all these inputs, we're putting oil into the mix and fertilizer and we're plowing soil and we're growing corn and then we're transporting it and we're cooking it into ethanol and then we use it. And we don't really know, is that a good thing to do or is that a bad thing to do? Are we getting more energy out of that process than we're putting in? We don't know. And But if we decided we didn't want to put money into that, would we put it into insulating existing structures? Well, we don't know. We just don't have the answers to that. So right now I'd say we have this commission, it's funded through some department, it's independent, and it's examining every single thing. And we no longer make decisions based on how much does this cost versus how much does that cost. We make decisions now on where does it fall on this list of things that gives us the highest return back to, to society on an energy basis. Because that's the stuff that gives us our societal complexity. That's what drives society. That gives us all the things that I know and love. I really want to maintain a very rich, very detailed, complicated society. It runs on net energy. Very few people are aware of that connection. And we're gonna have a hard time really communicating unless we know what it is. We're really flying blind at this point. So if I could do that, bang, we'd do that. And next thing you know, it would be this policy that would say, every decision has to pass through this filter of understanding how it flows through the energy process and whether it returns something to us or not.